Hi everyone. So this is an update. I am nine weeks tomorrow and I just thought I'd give an update. It's been a couple weeks um, but I've been really tired, um, nauseous, normal pregnancy stuff that goes on the first trimester. Um, I did, I finished the first round of P90X and then I took a week off and that was great. I still, I still like did some cardio stuff that week, just a little bit, um, walking or something. No, I didn't. Never mind. I took the whole week off. I was going to do two weeks off and then I decided just to do one. And then, um, just feeling like really tired every day, more tired than I've ever felt with my other three pregnancies. Uh, so I committed to working out five days a week instead of six. And so last week, I was so nauseous and sick last week that I only worked out four, which I just was like amazed that I didn't work out four because with the other three pregnancies, I didn't, I didn't do anything my first trimester other than just sleep or do the minimum. Um, so, um, so, okay, so then last week I worked out, I think I only worked out four days last week. Did I say that? Yeah. And then, um, this week my goal is five again which I think I'm going to be able to do. I'm not as nauseous this week. I'm just really tired and uh, not sleeping too well because I'm peeing like five or six times, seven times a night sometimes. So I'm trying not to drink anything the last couple hours before I go to bed but that's really hard because often I work out at night and then I'm really thirsty and so um, and it's amazing because I'm even like getting woken up to have to go to the bathroom. I mean, there's that initial go to the bathroom when you first go to bed thing, and then there's that in the morning you wake up and you really have to go. But it's like that like five, six times a night, and so I'm getting, I'm not sleeping that great. But um, I'm trying to think what else is kind of crazy. And then having three little boys who are two, three, and five is pretty crazy. And then my five-year-old started kindergarten last week. So I've been taking him to school every day. And it's just a lot. It's just a lot to get all the housework done, you know, get the kids fed, you know, whatever. Play with them. And then on top of that, be nauseous and tired and have to drive people to school and um, and then have to fit workout in. So I've, I've been really challenged by all that combination of stuff, but I feel like it's easy, I feel like having the 90 days of the P90X workout really taught me to be disciplined each day, so I really felt like I'd been through those conversations in my head so many times of, I'm just not going to do it, I'm not going to do it, okay, I'm going to do it, okay, I'm not going to do it, okay, I'll do it, okay, I'm just, like, I already know where that goes, and so I'm just like, you know what, I'm exhausted, I'm tired, I need to go to bed, but it's not going to kill me to do 45 minutes, 50 minutes of you know, Tony Horton for a little bit. Um, so I'm doing day one, day three, and day five uh, from the P90X program, Can, starting my round two, I guess you could call it. And then on those days in between, I'm running two to three miles. Um, so that's kind of what I decided to do for right now, at least the next three months. Um, which seems to be fine. The running has been amazing. I've really felt great running. Um, surprisingly able to run without too much effort, which was great because I, before starting the P90X, you know, four months ago, whatever it was, um, I wasn't even running that much. So that just means that somehow my body got in running shape without ever actually running, which is not a text. <laughs> um, I think, I think was pretty amazing. So, I'm not doing core synergistics. This is my favorite. My ab muscles immediately became goo. Like, five weeks pregnant, I was unable to do ab rip rex. I could just feel the muscles, like, separating as I was trying to do a push-up. Or, uh, any sort of the ab rip rex moves. It was just like... <laughs> so, I just said, you know what? It's fine. I'm going to do other things that will work that core. But what I've noticed is that when I'm doing push-ups and pull-ups, you know, you use your core and you don't even realize you're using your core. It's so much harder to do push-ups and pull-ups when your core muscles are jello or 
softened because of all the hormones or the 20% of increase of blood flow that's now pumping through my body that I didn't have to have before, which I didn't realize until last week when I was online and I was like, oh, my blood volume has multiplied. Another great thing. <laughs> so, um, so when I'm doing push-ups, it feels like there's like lead in my muscles. I, I don't know how to explain it. I So I started to do some normal ones and then I would go down to my knees which makes sense because I'm not using my I'm I'm able to use my lower body better if I um, put my knees down and it's less on my arms but I'm still getting a good somewhere <laughs> I'm I'm still really working those muscles good I can feel it so you know before I was pregnant I was doing like 20 push-ups and feeling great and now I'm doing 10 and feeling like it's dying, like there's lead in my arms. So, but if I go on my knees, I can do five, six, seven, eight more and keep keep pushing it a little bit more. So, um, and then my husband bought me the push-up bars. So as my tummy grows, I'll be able to have some more space there, um, which is already kind of bumping out. You can kind of, let's see, there it is, right there. So, um, that's fun. And I'm kind of in that tweener stage where I just look kind of fat. <laughs> but, whatever. And I'm trying to think, this is kind of fun. I'm kind of liking this video thing. Um, my eating has been okay. But, like, when you're nauseous, you just eat whatever you can eat. But I had some really great days, and then I'd have, like, a, and I just want to eat a muffin, you know. So, whatever, that's been fine. Um, but I'm looking forward, I'm nine weeks, I got a few more weeks left, and then I'm hoping to get that energy boost in the next trimester, where I'll start to feel more energy. Like today I cleaned out the car, and I just was like, whoa, that was, that was a lot of work. <laughs> so, alright, I think that's it. I'll probably not post again until week 11. I'll probably go another week, but, um... Yeah, thanks for watching, those of you who have signed up and are watching, and um, looking forward to the next few weeks. Alright, see you later.